Saturday guys we've got laundry going we've got housework going we are all busy 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 Eric's in there putting together the bed frame for Robbie that just came in the mail got lots of stuff going on it's a good day it's gonna get a ton of stuff accomplished today and I'm very very excited about it all right bed is successfully off the floor now he's got some space underneath for storage which is good because he's got all this stuff um it looks good sweet I'm happy with this and it was only like $75 for the bed frame. I'll link it down below if you guys are interested. I'm not getting any kind of like kickback or anything from it. It's not an advertisement. I just found it on Amazon, bought it, and it seems to be pretty good. Of course he hasn't slept on it yet, but what do you think, bud? Let me test it. Oh, perfect height. Hmm, good. We'll just have to get you a headboard at some point, but for now. What's a headboard? Goes at the head of the bed. Why? Just looks a little bit nicer, keeps, I don't know. I don't really know what the purpose of a headboard is, but. To keep you from bashing your head on the wall? Maybe. Because then you bash it on a piece of wood instead. Maybe. Oops. <laughs> so for dinner tonight, we're gonna have some Philly cheesesteak sandwiches, I guess, steak sandwiches. Um, we've got some bell pepper in here and there's some white onion down at the bottom. And some mushrooms. Austin's not the biggest fan of mushrooms, but honestly, you don't taste them, so no big deal, right, Austin? No mushrooms. No, I don't like mushrooms. Well, you won't taste them, I promise. Yeah, I know. I've... Like, if you weren't standing here, you probably would never even know they're in there. So, um, we're gonna get these cooked up, and then we're gonna put these to the side and cook up our steaks, assemble our sandwiches, throw some cheese on them, throw them under the broiler for a few minutes, and that's gonna be dinner along with some tater tots. I'll show you guys when it's all done. We all thought he was doped, didn't we? Now he took a look at Kiddos are making reindeer chow. And Austin's eating all the ingredients. I already had some of them. So. I will put the recipe down below of the recipe that we're using. I think every single time we use a different recipe. But what are you doing? Don't get cat hair. And reindeer chow. It's not kitty chow. This guy's been pretty busy today. I'll show you his project here a little bit. Oh, the kiddo's reindeer chow turned out perfect. It's super yummy. All right, you guys. So this was Eric's project today. I'm going to turn the light on, okay? Okay. So, you guys know we gave Robbie our old mattress, which meant that he upgraded from a twin-size bed to a full-size bed. Well, the beds that these kids were in were actually bunk beds that we took apart, the two twins. Since we were no longer using the second bunk bed, my husband took it and he converted it to a loft bed so that Austin has much, much, much more space in his room now. And I can use those other shelves. Yep, and this, which was back there and these shelves were not accessible are now totally accessible he's got so much more room so much more storage how do you like it buddy i love it so and then bed oh. and how do you like the bed well it's i i like sleeping up top for some i really like sleeping up top and i can see the TV because initially we were gonna have the TV over here now you can only see it from the bottom yeah we're gonna then, put it in here but we wanted to put it somewhere where he could see it both if he's sitting out and hanging out under here or well, well he had uh, that's not what I was gonna say I wasn't gonna continue what he was gonna say but he actually moved it there just temporarily well to do something over there to help to help make the to make the bed yeah and it, yeah. i liked it there so yeah so we decided to leave it there that means his hooks back there have to move but not now not today so yeah this is um a great solution to the problem that we were having with his bedroom being teeny teeny tiny that now he has floor huge. space he can hang out under here um once the christmas tree comes down he'll have even more space we put it. little twinkly lights up under here 
Um, I think we're gonna hang some curtains or something up here, make it his little hangout spot. Oh, I like that idea. Yeah? You didn't tell me that before, yes. <laughs> I like that. So, and that was Eric's little project today. It was kind of um, unplanned. We didn't have to buy anything for this project. We just reused everything we had at home. And um, I think it's great. Plus that vent is no longer covered up by his bed. So it's gonna stay much warmer in here in the winter and cooler in the summer. It might seem little to you, but this is huge. <laughs> for you, yeah. It's like twice the size you had before. Oh, your puppy chow. All right, so say goodnight, Austin. We're gonna go ahead and end the vlog here. Night. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching, guys. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Say bye, Patches. <laughs> bye.